it been tough, but at the same time, you know, I was just been patiently waiting and just practicing hard and making sure that I was ready when I finally got to come back. So. The toughest part was the Missouri game, watching that game. Um, our guys were so pumped up. And it was the environment you want to play in, hostile environment you want to be. Um, but, you know, I was glad we got the win. Most out of all players. Did you were you, were you relieved that you got when I was, I was thinking a guy like you that if they'd have lost you that felt obligated, I mean felt responsible in some way? Were you relieved that they won that game? I was. You know, I would have felt pretty down if I if we were lost, you know, I, I couldn't contribute. You know. How tough was this whole situation just, you know, having your name out there like that and having to just you know, go through that? Uh, it's, it was pretty tough. It's been a learning experience, and I've learned a lot from it, and now I just got to move forward. What have you learned from it? Um, I've learned that I just need to put myself around people that bring the best out of me, and, you know, that's about it. Sanders, were you at all worried that you might not be back this season when it, when it happened and it all broke? Did you? Um, no, I wasn't worried, you know, because um, you know, I've stayed out of trouble since I've been here. You know, the coaches know, you know, the story behind what happened, and, you know, so I wasn't really worried. Did, what was your reaction to getting to games? Um, I mean, I, I was surprised because, you know, like I said, you know, what, what, what really happened, you know, they know what happened, but, I mean, <clears throat> any time a player gets arrested for anything, that has to be some suspension, so. I mean, there were some rumors last week about you maybe being able to make the trip. Was that what was going on, or were those rumors unfounded? Um, it was it was a possibility. There was a chance, but you know, we didn't want to see anybody else coming back just so we could win. We, you know. When you say it was too late to appeal, what, what, why is that? How does the process work? Um, you know, like I said, if I would have came back, like they would have just flipped it at the last second. It would have been like I was coming back just to. Sure, the wins was in. Rather than if I'd have done it months ago, back in the summer, you know, it would have been different. Last year, uh, Cornelius Washington said that, um, you know, when a guy gets in trouble, Coach Rick is, is fast to say, you know, when, when there's a lesson or whatever to be learned, you know, he can forgive and, and put it behind him. I mean, does this feel like this is water under the bridge and it's kind of just kind of, you know, except yeah, that you guys um, have taken what you took away from it? Yeah, he definitely forgave me, you know, way back, you know, we've been. Close ever since the situation. Um, so, you know, that situation is over and done with. And it's much I mean, I'm just anxious more than anything. I'm not really trying to go out there and show off. You know, I'm just trying to do what I've been doing, you know, since I've been here. That's just work hard in practice and execute on Saturdays. Coach Rick was saying that, you know, there's more to uh, punishment than missing a game or things like that. And you've feels like what you've had to go through off the field and, you know, the public scrutiny, the embarrassment and stuff is, is harder than the missing the games? Yeah, that, that was the biggest punishment, what I had to go through you know, off the field. What I put my family through, the university through, all that. You know, missing the game, that was, that was probably the easiest part of the punishment. What did your parents have? I mean, what did you say to them, and, and what kind of advice did they have for you? Um, they backed me. You know, they they told me, you know, just learn from this and move forward. You know, when you get back on the field, just make sure everyone knows that you're there. So. Thanks, guys.